Hi, dear investors. You know, I want to talk about no load and no fees kind of concept in our syndication. Uh, the reason is because a lot of times people like to put in money in the mutual funds and things like that. And they try to see, okay, you know, how much is the load? What's the cost of doing the operation? How much money is going to come out of my investment? If I buy stocks, I have to give $12.95 or $8.95 per stock. You know, I mean, per transaction, things like that. What kind of, you know, fees are the banks charging or mutual funds charging and things like that. So people are really prone to asking, oh, what are the fees? What kind of fees you are taking, you know, in this syndication or well, how much is my 100,000 is going to be invested? Face value of 100,000 or you're going to take out the fees, which is like 5% or 10% and then I only get paid on 90,000. Well, I've got a great news for you. See, in real estate, we do have fees, which we charge acquisition fee or disposition fee or closing costs are there and the attorney fees are there and all that. But that's all built in the equity of the uh, product that we buy. The properties we buy, there is a, you know, a differential between the real price and then also the equity, which is in there. That's where these fees come out of. So when we tell the investors that there is no load or no fees, that's really true because their 100,000 or 200,000 or 500,000 will be invested into the real estate LLC. With the LLC that they will be doing, getting the private placement memorandum, PPM, and the offering, you know, documents and everything they will sign. They will, 100,000 of that will be invested or 200, and they will get returns also quarterly. We pay quarterly. Quarterly returns are given out also to the investors and they get it on 100,000 or 200,000. No discounts, no money is taken out. And when we sell the property in five years also, they will get their whole money back, the 100,000 or two or 500,000 initial investment. And they have also gotten all the cash flows during the quarters up to the five years or four years, as long as you have kept that asset and then the equity gain is the other third portion that they get back. So they get their cash flow, they get their in initial investment back, and now they get the equity gain portion also given to them. So it's very important that you let them know in our syndication model, you do not lose any fee or loads or anything like you do in mutual funds and stock market and things like that.